we don't see that OpenAI has that now, right? Like they, 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 they don't have some amazing new revenue model innovation that they're boosting with their early lead in the conversational LLM market, right? I mean, I mean, their way of making money is API calls and subscriptions, but any anyone can anyone can can do that right that that doesn't have these sort of yeah flywheel increasing returns dynamics that gives you gives you more more defensibility in in fact in fact it's not really clear how google or microsoft will make money from from these things right i, I mean i mean cuz they sort of which is probably part of the reason google didn't rush to launch their own generative AI chatbots. I mean, apart from them feeling uneasy about the amount of unrealistic, non-factual bullshit they generate. I mean, also replacing a list of search results with a natural language summary doesn't have an obvious (laughs) advertising business model associated with it, right? So it's it's not clear. I mean, Google can try to intersperse paid stuff with the barred results but that's that's uglier than putting ads to the side of your list of of uh of links right but but open ai also doesn't have such a defensible business model right because subscriptions yeah. are not that that defensible against anyone else offering the same thing with a slightly lower subscription price or something right so so yeah i think it's it's definitely you know chat gpt was a black swan event from the econ- economic point of view and it's a, a threshold in terms of practically deployed technology but it's really like uh opening up a new era and things are pretty wide open in this new era and it's it's not at all clear if OpenAI will be the Google or the Yahoo of this of this new era. So Jim Rickards has just recorded a video that's not available to anyone in the public, and he's gonna be talking about how this upcoming recession is gonna be fast, it's gonna be bloody, it's gonna be nasty. But at the same time, he's gonna show you how you can position yourself to profit from all of this chaos. Now we've made this video only available to our viewers, Go to LondonReal.tv forward slash Jim. Watch that immediately. I can't say enough good things about Jim Rickards. He understands the global economic system better than any guest I've ever had on London Real. His predictions are almost uncannily true. And you can learn how to profit from his vision, from his expertise, and his understanding of economics. So go to LondonReal.tv forward slash Jim or click the link below. It's an excellent, excellent look on what's gonna happen in the future and how you can position yourself to profit from that. Jim is one of the best in the business, one of my favorite guests on London Real, and he's very, very good at predicting the future and showing us all to profit from it. So click the link and I hope you enjoy. Hey, it's Brian Rose, founder of the DeFi Academy. I've told you my four week crypto bootcamp is amazing, but don't take my word for it. This is what my students are saying. The DeFi Academy was an amazing experience for me. It took me totally out of my comfort zone. In this course, I was challenged, I was held accountable, and pushed to do things that honestly weren't always easy. It's been phenomenal, and I can't believe uh, we're already up on our four weeks. It has flown by. Going through this DeFi accelerator, by far, was one of the best courses I've taken. You do this course, you really get into the nitty gritty of the activities that will make you comfortable with decentralized finance. Thank you so much to Brian and everyone at London Real and the DeFi Academy for even putting together an amazing course like this. Anybody else that wants to do it, please sign up. It is well worth the money.